Hey everyone, it's Galen with GoCodes. Let's go over some of the customization options available with the Asset List View. With List View pulled up, we can click Columns for a drop-down menu. We can add and take away a few options. You see the List View instantly updates and will be saved in your browser. At the bottom, you'll also see some additional fields like Last Updated, Last Changed By, and these can be really useful as well. You're also able to rearrange columns and change sorting order. Another cool feature is this filter button on each column. Let's filter home location and search for Glendale. This will pull up only the items matching that location. You'll see a message pop up on the side that a filter is applied. We can click on Reset Grid over here to clear that out and get back to our standard view. There are also powerful group search features. Let's enable this grouping button in the corner. Now we can take something like location, drag it up to the top, and now we're able to see the assets organized by location groups. You will also see that we provide a count of the number of items in each group. We have the option to export our asset list in PDF or Excel format as a report for use externally. You can also use the asset list to print labels. You can either print labels for all your assets, or if you perform a search or a filter, you can print labels just for those assets. Lastly, if you want to check in or check out multiple assets at once, you can select them using the mouse and control shift key on your keyboard, then choose update assets or check out. This option can really save you time. Thanks for watching. For more information on GoCodes, you can check out our channel or go to www.gocodes.com.